This video is sponsored by Flux Design Index. Do you struggle making decisions? Do you find flipping a quarter just doesn't provide you with enough options? Should we stop this infomercial style? Yes. Paul here and we have another desk toy for you today. It is the Decision Maker. I'll make sure to put a link in the description below so you can check it out for yourself. We're gonna be using this today to complete our review, making all the decisions for us. And the first decision is, should we roll that intro right now? And we get reorganized. So I guess it will come sometime else in the video. The Decision Maker is a hefty piece of metal coming in at 260 grams or 9.2 ounces. It has a matte silver finish around the outer portion and a chrome silver finish in the middle portion. And the fit and finish is really good. It's smooth to the touch. I did have one little spot on this and it could be unique to this one where there's a little itty bitty dent or markup next to maybe over here, maybe it hit against something. Not that big of a deal, just worth noting. The outer portion has eight different answers on it and it spins around the inner portion, which has an indicator. I ran a test to see how many times it lands on each of the different answers to see if it distributes evenly. And I'll give those results based on what this answers. Tomorrow, why did I do this? There's a foam pad on the bottom that keeps it from slipping. For the most part, if you give it a really fast turn on a slick surface, the indicator may spin just a little bit, but that doesn't cause any issues. Should I tell them how loud it is? Pass the buck. The decision maker is quiet and won't bother those around you. By the way, this video is sponsored by Flux Design. The Index is a small metal gadget with embedded neodymium magnets, which provides a distinct tactile feedback as you rotate it. You can also rub it like a worry stone. What I love about it, it is small, discreet, and completely quiet. You could use this at your desk, in a meeting, you could have it in your pocket, nobody will notice. It comes in six different styles made up of different colors, finishes, and materials. The lighter weight aluminum version has lower inertia, making it a bit more clicky as you rotate it around, where the heavier brass and stainless steel versions, they are a bit smoother as you rotate them around. I'm really liking the stainless steel one. I find myself naturally fidgeting with these while I'm working or I'm in meetings, and this will look professional in just about any setting. I'll make sure to put a link in the description below so you can take a look for yourself. Now back to the video. Obviously, you're gonna be using this to make all your future decisions, but what else is it good for? First of all, due to its hefty size, it does make a really good paperweight. It's gonna keep those papers in place. They're not gonna blow off your desk or move around and help you keep things organized. Second of all, it makes for a good fidget toy on your desk or conversation piece. You can sit there and play with it with one finger while you're in a virtual meeting. You can spin it around and obviously make your decisions. And as a fidget toy, you could also use it if you have large enough hands as a giant fidget spinner. Probably not how most people use it, but it can be used that way. It's a bit odd how we reorganize this review, but the decision maker knows best. Don't question it. Let's roll that intro. We filmed the first part of the review yesterday, and now we can finally get to the distribution of the answers. Ideally, since there's eight of them, it should land on each of them one eighth of the time or 12 and a half percent. But since every unit's not perfect, some of them will probably lean to some answers more than the others. After a bunch of tests, I did find that some of them were a little more often, which were the wishy-washy ones, which were past the buck at 18% and maybe at 20%. And those are maybe some of my favorite answers. If this doesn't have all the answers you're looking for, there's also a legal version and a college version with different answers on them to let you know whether you should settle or not, or perhaps even take a nap. I do think this makes for a great desk toy as well as a gift, perhaps for a friend or a coworker. 